Welcome to the enthralling world of One Life to Live, a television series that captivated audiences during its run from the late 1960s to the early 2010s. As we delve into the annals of this iconic show, one cannot help but wonder, are there any lesser known facts or anecdotes about this TV series that fascinate you? Was there a particular scene or moment that left an indelible mark on your memory? Set against the backdrop of the fictional town of Landview, One Life to Live unfolded the intricate lives of its characters, navigating through love, drama, and unexpected twists. The show not only mirrored the societal changes of its time, but also managed to carve a niche for itself in the hearts of its viewers. Before we unveil some intriguing details about the series, we invite you to share your most cherished memory or personal experience related to this timeless TV gem. We would love to hear your stories and memories in the comments below. Now let's uncover some random facts about One Life to Live. Did you know that the show was groundbreaking for its portrayal of diverse characters and social issues, tackling subjects that were often considered taboo on television during that era? The series skillfully navigated through topics such as interracial relationships and socioeconomic disparities, contributing to its cultural significance. Furthermore, the show's enduring popularity can be attributed to its compelling characters, each with their own struggles and triumphs resonating with viewers on a personal level. The dynamic storytelling and the ability to keep audiences hooked made one life to live a beloved staple in the realm of daytime dramas. As we reminisce about this iconic series, we invite you to share your insights and reflections. What stood out to you? Was there a character whose journey you found particularly compelling? Feel free to share your thoughts in the comments below. Your stories are the threads that weave the tapestry of the One Life to Live experience. Share your memories, anecdotes, and reflections. One Life to Live, a groundbreaking television series that debuted in 1968, emerged as a pioneering force in the soap opera genre. Created by Agnes Nixon, the show's inception marked a departure from traditional soap narratives by tackling social issues and incorporating a more realistic portrayal of everyday life. Set in the fictional town of Landview, the series revolved around the complex lives of the Lord, Buchanan, and Wallach families. As the narrative unfolded, iconic characters such as Victoria Lord Clint Buchanan and the indomitable Dorian Lord became central figures, each navigating a web of love, betrayal, and family drama. The show's unique style blended melodrama with a willingness to address timely social topics, including interracial relationships, mental health, and socioeconomic disparities. This innovative approach garnered a dedicated fan base and set one life to live apart from its contemporaries. The series left an indelible mark on popular culture by reflecting societal changes and pushing the boundaries of storytelling within the soap opera format. Despite its eventual cancellation in 2012, the legacy of One Life to Live endures through its impact on the television landscape and the enduring resonance of its characters. The show's ability to weave compelling narratives around relatable human experiences ensures its place in the annals of television history and its influence continues to be felt in subsequent generations of soap operas. One Life to Live stands as a testament to the power of storytelling in shaping cultural conversations. Ryan Phillip made television history in the 1990s with his role as Billy Douglas on the groundbreaking soap opera. Portraying the first openly gay teenager in a U.S. television series, Phillip's performance marked a significant milestone in daytime TV. From April 1992 to May 1993, he navigated the complexities of the character, breaking new ground in the portrayal of LGBTQ representation on screen. This breakthrough role not only propelled Phillip into the spotlight, but also contributed to the evolving landscape of television narratives, pushing boundaries and fostering inclusivity. The soap's commitment to addressing societal issues extended beyond groundbreaking character portrayals. In an unusual move, both One Life to Live and General Hospital were initially half-hour shows. However, when rival soaps on NBC and CBS expanded to an hour, ABC opted for a 45-minute format in 1977 aiming for cost-effectiveness and viewer retention. Yet, the strategy backfired as viewers turned off One Life to Live Early, switching to competitors. Within a year, both soaps transitioned to a full hour, highlighting the challenges and strategies networks faced in the competitive world of daytime television. These instances exemplify the series' willingness to adapt and take risks, reflecting the ever-changing landscape of television. From breaking ground with LGBTQ plus representation to navigating network strategies, One Life to Live remained at the forefront of innovation, 
leaving an enduring impact on the soap opera genre. The Sprawling World of One Life to Live, a trailblazing TV series from 1968, not only revolutionized daytime soap operas, but also left a distinct mark on the industry. Beyond its compelling characters and engaging storylines, the show made history as the last American daytime soap taped in New York City. This marked the end of an era as the production landscape shifted away from the city that had long been synonymous with soap opera production. One noteworthy aspect that showcased the series' commitment to grand storytelling was the creation of the Great Hall of Eterna in 1988. This monumental set, standing 32 feet high and offering a 360-degree view, was a testament to the show's dedication to pushing boundaries. The sheer scale of the set required a separate studio, underlining the logistical challenges faced by the production team. The Great Hall of Eterna became an iconic backdrop, further cementing One Life to Live's reputation for ambitious and innovative television production. As the show unfolded its narrative, it not only confronted societal issues, but also navigated casting decisions that would shape the characters we came to know. The role of Kelly Kramer, for instance, underwent a significant transformation. Originally conceived as a woman in her late 20s, the character evolved when Gina Tignoni took on the role. Telly became a girl in her late teens, showcasing the series' adaptability and commitment to dynamic storytelling. In the ever-evolving world of daytime television, One Life to Live stood as a trailblazer, whether it was in its choice of location, the grandeur of its sets, or the fluidity in character development. The show's legacy, marked by its ability to embrace change and take risks, remains ingrained in the history of soap operas, influencing subsequent generations of television dramas. One Life to Live, a true pioneer in the genre, continues to be remembered for its groundbreaking contributions. As we wrap up this journey through the captivating world of a timeless TV series, it's not just a farewell. It's an invitation to rewind the reels of your own memories. One Life to Live, with its rich tapestry of characters and intricate plot twists, has not merely graced our screens, but imprinted itself on the very fabric of our lives. Take a moment to ponder the episodes that made you laugh uncontrollably, the tear-jerking scenes that touched the depths of your soul, and the characters whose fictional lives felt like an extension of your own. Whether you joined the saga in its early days or discovered it in later years, there's an indescribable connection that binds us all through the vicissitudes of love, loss, and life. Now, as we bid adieu to this chapter, let's open the floor to youth custodians of these cherished memories. Share your favorite anecdotes, the characters who stole your heart, or the plot twists that kept you on the edge of your seat. Your reflections are the echoes of a collective journey, a testament to the enduring impact of storytelling that transcends the screen. As we close this narrative, we extend our deepest gratitude for embarking on this nostalgic expedition with us. Your time and interest have been the fuel that powered this exploration of shared narratives and emotional landscapes. Until we meet again in the realms of another captivating story, keep those memories alive, celebrate the moments that touched you, and continue weaving the threads of your own unique tale. With heartfelt thanks.